Hi, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for being here. Thank you for clicking. Thank you for watching right this second. If you didn't know, there's this thing called Tickety Talkity. There's this thing called TikTok. And inside that app, there's these people called TikTok stars. Now, I do a lot of videos with outfits. We already know this information if you watch my channel. So then one day I was scrolling through my profile and then I was like, oh my gosh, I am basically famous. I should move to LA. The idea I got from that was, wow, let me DM other famous people like me and ask them to choose my outfits. So that's what I'm going to be doing. TikTok stars are going to be choosing my outfits. Okay, so I'm going to try and contact them through TikTok because, you know, that's where I'm famous. Paris Hilton. Okay, the first person, obviously, is Charlie D'Amelio. In order to message them, you have to follow them. So let me follow her, and I'm gonna message her. Anyways, hey, Charlie D'Amelio. I know I'm so famous and, and everything. Can you please choose an outfit for me? There's like a little glitch here, so let me, let me, let me DM her on Instagram. Hey, can you choose a color for me, please? Random. I think she must be having phone issues on her side. That's why she's not responding, probably. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna scroll through her page and then find an outfit. And it's basically like she chose it for me. AKA, I'm gonna be clickbaiting you. Oh, it's my first time clickbaiting. I'm so sorry. It must be done. It must be done. Sorry. Here's her TikTok. Mm, okay, a black top. That's a pretty cute outfit. I think I have a black top and then just black bottoms. Uh, this is what we were working with. I had this over cropped shirt. So I put an undershirt, but it kind of balances with the bottom shoes because because that's just how it be. So this is gonna be it for the first outfit that Charlie Dambala Yayo chose for me. Period. Yep. Anyways. My camera has been having some difficulties since the drop. If you know what I mean with the drop is that it fell last video. Which is really sad on my part. So if you want to give me another G7X Mark II camera, I am open arms. Don't be shy. <laughs> my battery's gonna die. See you later. Okay, it's the end of the day, guys. It's the end of the day. There's not a lot of things, obviously, that I can do at home. So what you get is what you get. There's no adventures anymore. I can't go places and show my outfit. Everything is at home. I'm gonna go work out, so I need to change to gym clothes. So I need to take this outfit off. That's it for today's outfit that Charlie D'Amelio picked. Oh my gosh, Charlie D'Amelio picked my outfit? Wow. Okay, bye. Uh, Addison Ray. Hi. <laughs> Hi, welcome back to day number two of getting TikTok people to choose my outfits. We're gonna get Addison Ray to pick our outfit. So, of course, we're gonna go to her page. She's probably gonna respond to me. Uh, what can I say? Hey. 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 How Hi, you Adam. doing? So I guess that's not gonna work. Let me go on her Instagram and DM her. Can you please choose an outfit for me, any color, any style? As a precaution in case she doesn't answer, we're gonna have to do what we did with the last outfit, which is kind of like choose it for ourselves. Oh, here's one. This one that she did with James Charles. White shirt and jeans. Okay, I got the outfit on. Here it is. So I kind of combined both James Charles and Addison Ray's outfit. As you can see, I have the little shoelace that I got from one of my pairs of shoes that I had already lost one of the shoelaces from. Also, I don't know if I like it or not, the whole little shoelace belt thing, because I know it's like skater people use them to like hold up their pants when they're skating and stuff like that, but then it became a trend, and then everybody and their mamas and their grannies and then grandpas and their cats and dogs and their birds started doing the little shoelace thing. But I guess that's just how the internet works. So yeah, thank you Addison Ray for choosing my outfit.
Thank you so much. She never answered my DM. Well, I really do be clickbaiting you. Oh my gosh. Hey guys, this is my first time clickbaiting people. Um, if you enjoyed the clickbait, please leave a like for more clickbait. <laughs> Love that for me, love that for us, love that for you, love that for everyone, love that for the whole wide world, love that for everyone. <sighs> also, Lilo and Stitch, I feel like it's the best Disney movie. Disney, not Pixar. Pixar is like, it's like on its own category. But anyways, see you later. I forgot, Renegade, oh my gosh. I'm gonna rate this outfit. When I was looking in the mirror, you know, I was looking at the mirror, I was like, oh, okay. And the shoelace, I'm liking it. So I give this outfit that Addison Rae chose for me a 7 out of 10. Period. Okay, let's see who chooses my outfit tomorrow. Good night. Thought it ain't a Prashant, but it was cinnamon. Russell Sons of Bariki. It is me, Hannah Montana. Oh, 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 oh. oh, hi guys. Didn't see you there. Hi, how are you today? I've decided I'm gonna call this TikTok Stars Choose My Quarantine Outfits for a Week. That's a pretty nice title. I just switched it up on y'all. I feel like this one's gonna go a lot easier. We already know that the phones of these people might be like broken or something but for some reason and they can't reply to my text and my DMs. So we're gonna just have to do the same strategy as that last two for the rest of them. I really hope they get their phone fixed soon. Okay, the next person we're gonna do is called Noen Eubanks. And I think this one's gonna go a lot easier because he has some good outfits that I would wear. Okay, I think I'm gonna do this outfit. A black and white top and then some gray pants. His are sweatpants, but I don't have great sweatpants. Not into sweatpants. I'm not a sweatpant person. I kind of want to dye my hair like Dua Lipa style. You know what I mean? Like black and blonde. Hi. Dogs equals barking equals. Okay, <coughs> period. Turns out I do have sweatpants. You know, in quarantine, you can't always look the greatest. So this is kind of a, a relaxed outfit, you know? Uh, I'm gonna sit at home for three hours on TikTok kind of outfit, you know? But still kind of cute, you know what I mean? So thank you, Noen Eubanks, for choosing this outfit for me. I'll update you whenever I'm doing something slightly fun or slightly important. You know, now that I think about it, this outfit is kind of like a painter's outfit. So it inspired me to paint so I'm gonna paint I'm j I'll just check in with you every once in a while okay I'm back an hour later I forgot to give you updates but they were pretty boring I was pretty focused um, but gotta say I do be impressing myself sometimes Oof. it don't look that good on camera that's today's outfit the painter outfit apparently okay see you tomorrow <laughs> Today's person is gonna give us many, 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 many options to choose from, which is great. Emma Scheinberlein. So, I think I'm gonna do this one. I have some similar pants and a similar top. I'll be back with the outfit. Oh, here's the outfit. It's pretty accurate if I do this on myself. This top is really, really similar, but it's not the same. This one has kind of like collar kind of type of thing. I already knew this was gonna be the easiest one to like come up with and stuff and like figure out and anything. So I think this outfit has been my favorite one. Emma Chamberlain was not here to disappoint. It's been the most accurate outfit so far. So I rate this a 9 out of 10. Also, I rate this quarantine like a 5 out of 10 because half of the time I'm bored, half of the time I'm not bored, you know? Also, I rate TikTok at 8 out of 10 because it's really entertaining but you can get addicted. YouTube, I rate a 10 out of 10 because I love it. Netflix, 9 out of 10. They don't have all the shows I like. Chick fil A is like a 10 out of 10. If you want a TBH, comment down below and like this video. It really <laughs> smells like a public restroom. <laughs> I was struggling trying to figure out what other TikTok star I could use for this video and I spent like an hour trying to figure out what person and then another 30 minutes trying to figure out the outfit. I did that all off camera because I was getting annoyed. This one has to be my least favorite, sadly, because the person is one of my favorites. 
Brittany Broski kombucha girl. Yeah, so I found this picture. This outfit is like a 4 out of 10. Not her fault, my fault. I didn't have the right clothes. But I got clothes, I know you know what I mean. It's an old man outfit. Also, I did this trick for this shirt where I put like a string around my waist and then tuck inside so it's a crop top without actually having to crop it. Little TikTok hack for you. I'm gonna go eat and that's all I'm gonna do apart from editing. So if anything cool happens in my life, I'll let you know. But if not, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe and comment and, and follow me on my Instagram. Follow me on everything. Subscribe. Uh, okay, bye.